Hi, I'm Debbie, and welcome to my channel, Divine Destiny with Debbie. Today, we're reading for June 12th, 13th, and 14th, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday for my Sagittarius's. Hello, my Sagittarius. How are you? Well, you know that this is the weekend. You know that I use my two Radley Valentine decks. I use my Angel Tarot cards for my main reading. Okay. Ooh, yeah, cool. I use my Angel Tarot cards for my main reading, um, and then I try to pull one from my Archangel Power Tarot cards. I've prayed, meditated, and infused both decks with Reiki energy, but remember, this is a general reading. It may or may not resonate. Take what you like, leave the rest, okay? Okay, so one card popped out. It is face up. It is reversed. The other two are face down. The third one's also reversed. Strong energy. I read reversed cards as stronger energy. I am an intuitive channeler, and what that means is that I open myself up to my higher power and whatever the message is that needs to come out for whoever needed to hear it, it does. Now, we've had a lot of different energies. There's been eclipses. I've posted things on, a, I, on different social medias. Um, you know, we have, I told you, you know, Gemini season was pushing, this Gemini season was pushing boundaries. Um, and also, too, we have Mercury come, going retrograde on the 18th. It's all good. Take a breath. It will work out. And because we just had that full moon with you, with your energy, and my Sagittarius's, I feel like you're on fire. I feel like you're burning forth, and you're, you know, I mean, you're just like blazing. You're blazing. You're, you're, do, you know, you're, you're trailblazing. You're setting new pathways. And that's what I want for my Sagittarius's. Anyway, let's go on. Three cards. First card, again, this is reversed. Here we go. This is Archangel Uriel, the sun. Happy outcomes. This is, you know, again, sun, burning, blazing type of energy. This is things are going to work its way through. Feeling optimistic, feeling confident, okay? So the energies for you this weekend, if whatever this is that you've been wanting to go for, this weekend with the sun, go for it. Go for it, okay? Okay. So, happy outcome, brilliant new ideas that lead to success, have confidence in yourself. Next card, face down, here we go, the Empress. Okay, you know, I'm, I'm, and I love the Empress. I love some Empress coming here. Now, Archangel, uh, um, Archangel Gabriel, the divine messenger. The Empress to me is all about abundance, is about receiving your wishes. This is about, you know, and again, we are in the, full moon, your moon, to the new moon, which is waning, which is getting rid of things. But for my fire signs, I feel like it's going to be about receiving. And maybe it's because of that Mercury retrograde. Two weeks before, two weeks after, we're kind of in that shadow. So it's kind of like Mercury retrograde light. So, you know, things, things could be kind of slowing down and changing up a little bit. Use that energy. So lavish abundance, give birth to your dreams, nurture yourself and others. So, you know, I feel like you're having fun this weekend. I feel like, you know, and I don't know, maybe things are opening up more so for you. Um, you know, and this is that time to get your hair done, to get your, you know, your mani petties, whether you be male or female. It's time to take care of yourself. It's time to pamper yourself because it's like you're just, you're just like using this energy because, again, trailblazing. Okay, last card reversed. Here we go. The Lovers. The lovers. Now, I will tell you, this did come up um, in Leo also. Um, uh, yeah, but you have, Leo did not get three Archangel energy cards, major Arcana cards, okay? But this energy is healing. This energy is, you know, promoting wellness, promoting emotional, physical, spiritual, any type of, you know, what you want, you know, healing. But the lovers is also about attraction, the lovers is also about finding your place, okay? Finding that place that you can call possibly home, um, you know, and, you know, whether that be, a, you know, a relationship can be your work, job, career, can be personal, intimate, interpersonal. It can also be family or home. But I'm kind of feeling that this is about finding, and when I say this, I'm using this as what's coming to me. It's like finding that right pair of arms, okay? It's like, getting a big hug. It's like being, you know, it's being held. I feel like this, there's like this, like this big hug from the universe coming. Okay. Okay. 
So this is really strong. Intimate relationships, carefully weigh your decisions, good health, Archangel Raphael. So, I mean, you have these three, you have these real three very strong, very positive Archangel energy cards. And again, it's like the universe wants to give you a big hug. You know, we'll probably use that one if I can, you know, remember it. Anyway, let's say, let's go on. One last card. And you know what? I think, you, you know, you're more than ready for that. You are more than ready for that. So, you know, don't fight it. Don't fight it. Last card. This one is not reversed here. Let's see what this one says. The four of Gabriel, your energy, okay? Along with Aries and Leo. Time for a celebration, abundant rewards for hard work. Release yourself from burdensome situations. What else can we say? Let's claim this one. I'm claiming this for my Sagittarius's. I like it. Anyway, and I do shuffle these cards quite a bit before you even see me shuffle these. So I like this for you. So anyway, my Sagittarius says, you know what to do with the buttons down there. Hopefully it's a thumbs up. As always, my Sagittarius, know that you are loved. Stay safe and be blessed. Bye-bye.